you know, uh, oh man. <laughs> Buckle up. Hey, y'all ready to roll? Buckle up. We ready to roll. Ready to roll. Cause it's the legs you hold. Uh, 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 legs you hold. Uh, uh, mm. And it's for all of y'all. Who? All of, Who? All of y'all. All of y'all. Uh, uh. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Guess what, man? What's that cap? Talk to us, baby. <laughs> hey, I got thrown off. I ain't even tell you. Hey, I had I'm a ready. story for hey, you. I'm ready for it. Right, here we go. Hey, My ears are listen, open. listen, I wrote a book. Mm-hmm. Wrote a book last week. I know, right. you believe it or not, I wrote That's a pretty book. Pretty fast. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I like it. Hey. I like it. If anybody can do it, I know you can do it. Hey, wrote a book on how not to fall downstairs. It's, a, it's a step by step gut. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. I got it. I got it. I told my kids that. Oh, <laughs> Old knee slapper. Man. Knee slapper. Y'all like them knee slappers, don't you? Break gas. Hit the brake gas. Hit the brake gas. I'm going to do it like a driver do. Brake gas. Hit the brake gas. Brake Gas. Watch me do it like, like a driver do. Uh, bet I put a driver in the wall if he close you to better. me. I'ma hit the turn full speed. Watch me shoulder lead. Speed. Victory. Got it in the bag like some groceries. Mm. Supposed to be the best. Ain't nothing less. More oval yeah. team. Hanging with the bosses. Put some commas in my kind. Yeah, 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 that's my yeah, favorite yeah, line. That's my yeah, favorite yeah. line, man. Come on now. Because you know we got to come up there to lecture hall. Hey, we ain't even got contracts, man. We just, you know. Just hanging out. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Selects so, y'all. We yeah. learning. Doing it for the love of the game, Students man. Students of the game, man. Hey, somebody going to come bless us, man. Yeah, yeah, one yeah. Of these one of these days. days. One of these one days. days somebody's sure. out there going to be like, you know what? We need to make sure these boys keep going. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> we just keep going. First, they, we do. They, might, they might give us some new head, you know, new, new headphones, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I ain't gonna lie, I kind of like these, Cap. Hey, I mean, hey, they but them, pretty good. Man, them my um, them my mixing music mixing headphones, man. <laughs> <laughs> DJ, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, man. Uh, I still like them though. Hey, you know something that uh, not every episode I get to do, and that is introduce us. Sometimes I forget because not everybody know who we are. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm Cap Houston. Right here behind the board, behind the, one the ones and, and twos. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, the one and only Cap Houston. Been a NASCAR. This is season 19. Yeah. 19. <laughs> how you say it? No, no, how, yeah. no, how, Ke- how Kevin Hart. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Uh, Kevin Hart. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, and, Kevin Hart say, look like he don't take no mess either. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, that's all right. That's and all right. Uh, right here to my right, y'all, is uh, Mr. Marshall. You know, Mr. Marshall McFadden, seven years in, you know, yeah. just trying to pick up what you put down, Cap. You yeah, know, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm following your path. I'm hoping you do, because whatever so I put down, man, it's starting my, the way my back hurt now, it's hard for me to pick it up. So I'm glad. <laughs> That's why we I'm got you. I'm glad you picked it up for me. Yeah. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> like, oh, hey, hey, if I, I put it down now, it's so because I dropped it. <laughs> right, I saw you front squat the other week, Cap. Man. Hey, yeah, hey, we do. back hurt me. Yeah, 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 we back, we back. <laughs> we still in it. For sure. Hey, Marshall, who you got to your right, man? Man, I got my guy Big E, you already know. Big E, the unit. Know what time it is. The e- unit. Evan, Evan, Evan <laughs> the, the unit, unit claim. Come yeah. on, E, let them know how you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we all we all have uh, come from a football background. Yeah. And, um, you know, we all on the mic. We all got our headsets on. We're yeah. behind the camera. But also, you know, we got Jay New. Jay New, say what up. Hey, what's up? Hey, what up with it, Jay? <laughs> Every time, hey, hey, Jay, switch the cameras a little bit. Bump back. Yo, see that? You see that? Y'all see that? Y'all see that magic happening? Yeah, camera going yeah. back and forth. That's Jay New back there. A lot of behind the scenes stuff, behind the scenes action going right here in the lecture hall. Mm-hmm. Unseen action, hero. Action. Yeah, yeah. And uh that's part of part of the, the the lecture hall is for us to sit and talk and lecture and learn, learn a little bit about life, the mm-hmm. sport. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, NASCAR, that's what we do. And it kind of relate it to uh everyday life to where y'all can uh relate and maybe even answer some questions. Some people be asking asking different questions when we at the track. Yeah. But hopefully this platform would be one that we can inspire, you know, and also answer questions that people might have mm-hmm. for us. You know Absolutely. I mean? Yeah, yeah. So, Bristol. Mm. Oh, Bristol. Bristol Motor Speedway, y'all. Bristol Motor Speedway. Love it. Love it. Love Let's it. Let's talk about it. Short, short track racing. Half mm-hmm. mile? Yeah, half half, half a mile. mile. Is it um, the shortest, shortest NASCAR track? 
Yeah, well, if you if you uh, you can't count the clash, the clash is the kind of got well, to be the shortest yeah, now. Well. But half mile is you know those are those are the parameters for short tracks, right? It's a quick um, half mile too. Yeah, yeah. But so, you still can get lost at the track, though, right? You still yeah, can get. You can still. <laughs> <laughs> you can still go out the wrong. You can still go out the wrong <laughs> exit. Yeah, yeah. It <laughs> takes a special kind of guy to do it, a, but it, it can be done. <laughs> yes, it can. <laughs> I ain't gonna not, call no names, Brandon, but, but, but you know yeah, it's all good. Yeah, like it's. <laughs> like we, I, I always gotta um, repeat. I've been going to the track for 19 years, twice a year, um, and I've never, I never <laughs> knew that there was another gate yeah. that you can go out of and be like. I always went. You, I mm -hmm. mean, usually it's you go. One gate takes yeah. you to the parking yeah. lot you, to leave. But usually like, you go the way you came in. It's that simple. Like, what <laughs> makes you leave out of nothing? It's, a, it's, a, it's <laughs> one staircase. You go yeah. up it, yeah. and you're in the parking oh, lot yeah. you came in. And you, yeah. I felt yeah. bad. Not this guy. I felt bad. I yeah. felt bad. Yeah. <laughs> It's like it's almost like you gotta go looking for another way out, like intentionally yeah, on yeah. a mission. Like on he a, accidentally on a walked on a out that. I was like, like I, ain't even, I ain't know that was there either. Why Six you ain't helping my though? And we're like, yo, bro, it's it's this way, man. I, bro, look, bro, I would have lost my voice trying to scream at <laughs> Brennan across the from across a half mile track. I couldn't get to him. Yeah, um, Jared, he had to learn on his own. So Jared looking for both of them, like they were just in front. Of <laughs> oh, Jared was fired up too. Yeah. Oh, Jared was fired up. It was man. just in front. I'm like Jared. I'm sure they went. No, ain't no way they went. On that. And yeah. Jared stood there. Usually, I'd be like, I, I say something, and out of like knowledge, yeah. Jared be like, yeah, Cap, okay, yeah. You, you he was like, man, ain't no, ain't no way, ain't way, ain't no way they got away from me. Like, yeah, he was fired it's up. Like they was just in front of me. He was fired like, up. Hey man, bro. we got to explore parts of the track we've never seen before. Yeah, yeah. and that's and that's and that's a great lucky us. Yeah. It is good, good for y'all because y'all been a part of the track I've never seen before. <laughs> Twenty years in, <laughs> yeah, yeah, never, never knew that the backside of that track existed, man. <laughs> that, <laughs> but Bristol Motor Speedway, what's unique about that track, the half mile track, is stadium mm -hmm. style seating. I'm talking about wrap wraps around the whole track. The only track yeah. I know in the um, existence of NASCAR that mm -hmm. that the only one that has potential would be Martinsville. If they decided to build stands, but but Bristol used to be like that. It didn't always have uh, stands wrapped mm. around the way it did. But that I guess that's why you got the name, the last great Coliseum. Yeah, mm. you know, so that that's like take it back to the times, old days, and you know, being calling it the Coliseum. But adding the Coliseum race, you kind of like you know now now you got two tracks. It's kind of bump heads. Style, it's like yeah. Bristol's like nah, we the last great Bristol Coliseum. Won, yeah. I'm not gonna lie, Bristol was the one. Bristol. I think I think Bristol's uh, most iconic racetracks in the sport. Yeah, a lot of history but there. Uh, I think Bristol's only competition is Bristol, which is the fall race. Okay, yeah. I think right. I think the, the the last weekend race is direct competition. Fall race. It's hard to beat that fall race. Is the second race. Bristol yeah. in the playoffs? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It's in the yeah, playoffs. Yeah, right? yeah, the yeah, atmosphere yeah. is crazy. Yeah. yeah. Atmosphere is cool in the fall. I mean that jumbotron. The jump, yeah, the jumbotron. Jumbotron's kind of cool. And it's but can you that thing is held like four cables. Now the cables yeah. are the size. <laughs> I'm amazed about. It. Yeah. I'm amazed about it every time I see it. Every time I go, but I, yeah. each and every time I'm more amazed. Of, man, how just, just, just it's, 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 when you think jumbotron, you think like you know NBA style arena like yes, it's indoors, yeah. but it's. It's outdoors. And right. It's a yeah. jumbotron just hanging in the middle. And if it come down, they're taking everything out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. They're taking everything and out, you, man. Like, they should, uh, if any, um, anybody in Hollywood, they make a movie and they do some CGI stuff. Like, oh, man. That'd, that'd go crazy. That'd yeah, go crazy. That cat. jumbotron, because just those cables. It. If those cables, if any one of them snap, it's like. Oh, man. It... <laughs> I never thought of that, bro. Yeah, yeah. Like, I always look up and be like, man, that's a cool jumbo time. I never thought not, about, like, how, how is that holding not... up? <laughs> yeah. yeah. But it, it is uh, definitely a sight to see. The yeah. atmosphere in Bristol is, is crazy, especially when the car is on the, on the track, when mm -hmm. the. Engines, the the engines are revved up. It's loud. You can't. You, we can't conversate. De definitely the loudest track for yes. sure. Yeah, ain't even close. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely the loudest track. Loudest track. You got. Um, I mean, what else? They just they just repaved in 2020. Mm -hmm. I mm -hmm. think. Um, so that that is constantly being updated and um, you know just well well kept well yeah. kept track. Uh, they said there was a. Um, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, 
like it has the stadium style seating. I think there's been some football games played. There. Oh yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah plenty, yeah, yeah. plenty, plenty. Well, college well, I know, games. Um, I know. Um, was it the Vols in Virginia? Just look Virginia it up. Tech. I think no, I think Virginia Tech was. Yeah, it's multiple games that have been played there since I think nineteen sixty one. But the first to not up to now. No, well the, the I know the first game well, the first game without of my knowledge, uh, Tennessee Vols. And I wanna say it was maybe it was Virginia. Virginia, not Virginia Tech. Virginia, Virginia Tech and Tennessee the Vol, yeah. played there, I believe. So it was, yeah, yeah. They do concerts there as well, right? If I'm not mistaken, concerts, yeah, all, yeah. it's everything. Hey, you know. and speaking speaking of concerts, mm -hmm. it's another moment for me to give y'all a little tidbit of Bristol history. Okay. Because they beat Virginia Tech. I have been a part of Bristol NASCAR history, being one of the first crew members to have their own song being played in the driver's intro. Mm. That's impressive. In the greatest Coliseum, the last great Coliseum. The last, yeah. What, driver, world, was that, right? what driver was that, Cap? First one to uh, use my song for intro was David Gillen. Mm. Back that, in the day. That, hey, shout out to David. Hold on, wait a minute. Is, yeah. is that, is that Todd, Todd Gillen's Todd's dad? dad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, that's, that's hey, I respect, I respect that. Yeah. That's Every day, because you because so, you look so young, bro, and yeah. like you work out with us like it's nothing. Yeah, like, be forgetting. I'd be yeah. forgetting like we be forgetting to respect your yeah, elders. Yeah. <laughs> like to keep reminding I didn't you. want to call you old, but I was like, I'd be forgetting you up there sometimes, yeah. bro. You be I'm talking like, about people's dad that you pitted bro, with, I'm and literally, raced with. And, I'm literally like, he was like, hey, how's he still racing now? Because I'm, I'm grandfathered in. Mm. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, literally grand, That's grandfathered in. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah. So um, the second person to use one of the songs is um, uh, Jamie McMurray. Oh, McMurray. Yep. Jamie McMurray used the song for the intro. Ganassi, early Ganassi days. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And uh, third driver, three times. You Ross. Know, Ross. Yeah, Ross. Yeah, I remember Ross, Ross for sure. Going. Now, the fourth time the song was played, um, Heather DeBow, uh works for, she's a, a reporter and anchor out, out there. And I don't know who she was with at the time, but yeah. she mm -hmm. um, she works close with Jamie Little. And she had she had control of the reins at, at, at last. It was a fall, mm -hmm. and she was uh, hit up some folks that she knew. It's like play this song, and they played it. And as they was playing it, that's when they made the Zane Smith announcement, and they was in in the press press oh, conference yeah, room. Yeah. But they was watching us dancing on the screen in the middle of the press. Interrupted the press conference. Yeah, yeah watching us on the screen, jumping around under the hallways. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. That's so, dope. That's dope. So there's a little bit of um. I mean, I just nobody even knows that Cap Houston is a part of uh, Bristol Motor Speedway history. Well, right? if they didn't know. They know now, Cap. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah, so uh, get me on that stage. Uh, <laughs> get me on that. Get me on that stage. Let me open up. Let me, we can call it like a mic check. Mic check with Cap. You know, they always have uh, bands or somebody come mm -hmm. through. You can just let me just let me open it up, warm it up for them. Mic check one two one two. Yeah. That ain't a hard yeah, act. So I think yeah, I think man. they'd be happy that you do that, Cap. Shoot, they had maybe it going come. when we were setting up the pit boxes. Yeah. They, they was out there getting to it. Shoot, yeah. I start to go out there for a minute. Let me, <laughs> yeah. You know something? Let me. There's a lot going on. We're I'm setting up go. the box, man. Yeah. I swear, like all the celebrities <laughs> and concerts be going on where we're setting they up. Setting up, watching yeah. it like up. the Rock was. Uh, yeah. was what was that Atlanta or whatever? What's it, what the, you, you know, uh, Goldberg was out there. Yeah, yeah. Doing doing finishing moves yeah. on, on <laughs> random fans and stuff. And who was up there putting the canopy up? This in Bristol. Yeah, he's doing intros. He did the drive intros. He grabbed some random. Guy was like, hey man, put him on his shoulder. Heard this guy been talking and smack. And hey. the next thing I know, he's like over his head. He like, yeah. hey, he like he ain't bumped into me. Oh yeah. Yes. Sir. What you what you would have did? Yeah, what you done? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> some of them, got, hey, some of them moves, some of them wrestling moves look fake until you get put in one. Yeah. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> you upside down, looking at the stars. <laughs> hey, going viral, yeah, boy. Y'all see what happened to Marshall, bro? Yeah, nah, yeah. I don't need that in my life. Nah, my kids can't see me. I don't even. Know. I don't need yeah. that happen to you. Yeah. Not by no fictional character, man. <laughs> <laughs> Not actor. Yeah. Oh no, god. No. So we went. Now we got. To, let's talk about the racing a little bit. Um, let's get into it. Truck race. Truck race Saturday, man. Mm -hmm. uh, two hundred and fifty laps. Yeah, two hundred and fifty laps. Real interesting race. Trucks. Um, trucks was trucking. Mm -hmm. Trucks is doing do, doing what they normally do. We had good. We had a good truck. Great truck, we had a, a good great, truck. Uh, yeah, great yep. truck for sure. Yep, um, ran in the top what five, top three most of the day. Right, right, and this you is know. a perfect opportunity to be like transparent and you know vulnerable with the uh, you know with with the show, right? Mm -hmm. um, 
as professional athletes, we go out there and we pit race cars, and mm-hmm. sometimes things happen, right? Yeah. Whether it be in our control or not, and there's some things we can control, some things we can't. But you know, this situation we dropped the ball. Came, yeah, dropped the ball. Came dropped in a you know, uh, little debacle mm-hmm. on pit road, right? Um, and they, like I said, we can take it, take it, and be like, you know what? We missed it there. Let's go. Let's go to. Uh, let's go to Coda and get it right. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, and it feels bad to be a part of pulling. And, and then you know, Nick drove his ass off getting back, getting back up. It and then got caught did. in some late, you know, some uh, late uh, in, in interactions with the trying to get back up there. Yeah. Right. Mm-hmm. And that's just some of those things. That's part of it, right? You know, it's part um, of the game. Man. Yeah, it's yeah. part of it. it. Happens. And that's why I, I I do like. I can't just be. We just can't be on the show and just bypass any talk about everything everybody else's problems and not yeah. Skip hours, yeah. Yeah. yeah especially yeah. when we're still pitting you know and, but that's and, that's the beauty of it though you know when you start building core relationship with these uh these crew chiefs and owners and things of that nature and you you want to build of that they can go they can trust us when we go over pit wall mm-hmm. now they not always they they don't think we always going to be perfect right. but understanding that when it's not perfect I think you call it a mulligan cap. Mm-hmm. That's our mulligan right there. They yeah. understand that. Even some even some people took some heat for it. But yep. still, at the end of the day, you build those relationships. And when you go out there and handle your business like a professional, so when you do have those debacle, you're able to get another opportunity. And the only way to get and the only way to, the only way to uh, to get that bad taste out of your mouth is go. But this week, yep. and you know, do what we do. What we was doing each uh, weekend and week out, so uh, I agree. Just grateful for the opportunity just to go back out there and yeah. do what we do. Then we can, you know, yeah, get yeah. that ball rolling again. Yep, yep. Then the uh, so the nineteen end up winning. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I just, but like, bro, I feel like that shed so much on so much light on like when you see these drivers win, like, yeah, like that driver didn't just win, like that pay crew won. Absolutely, like, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying. Absolutely. Like that pit crew played it. And mind you, our, uh, by the way, Trackhouse pit crew was on that 19 truck. Yeah, shout out, yeah, to, those shout out to those guys. Shout out to those guys. But mm-hmm. hey, it's, it's like, it just goes to show, like, even on Cup Day, like, when you see those guys cruising through Victory Lane, like, that pit crew played a big hand in it because they didn't fumble the ball that day. Right. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, right, right. Shout out to those guys. Yeah, yeah. Most, most definitely. Most definitely. We, yeah. um, we get now we're getting into the you know the meat and potatoes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. the heart of it. The heart. <laughs> we're getting to the we're gonna get into the, the the heart of racing at Bristol Motor Speedway, Absolutely. right? Um, and to me, when we showed up, like when we showed up Sunday, not like what you you thought. I yeah. think I think the plan that week was to go four stops max. That's how it's been previous races. It's yeah, been like my last meeting before leaving the shop was, oh, you ain't gonna get that many cracks at it. Yeah, <laughs> we won't have a lot of opportunity there, so make yeah. make make those pit stops count. Right, yeah. right, right. And so for for whatever reason, the um, tire wear was really really in the red zone. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, which changed strategy, which also gave a, a different race. And I was online. There's a whole lot of different reviews and, and mm. different opinions love on it. it. Love it. And then there's a lot of people, a lot of people loving, love it. you know, loving everything yeah. that they, that, that went down. Um, it was like 54 lead changes. Mm. Yeah. yeah. It was, I, I, I like the fact that it was that dicey. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like uh, the, the year before, I mean, I mean, obviously, I like Bristol because of the the, the stadium, the jumbotron, like yeah. the style of racing. I think it's cool, but it, it did go really long last year. So it was just like whoever could hold on the longest, those yeah. were the guys that was mm-hmm. that was winning the race. But I like the fact that it got dicey. Like, hey man, your, your pit crew got to show up, yeah, nine to ten times this race. So mm-hmm. right, you know, made the best full team win not just a driver not just a driver just going out there yeah. killing 100 laps like your whole team got to win this week brother go, like yeah. everybody so yeah. everybody kept coming down pit road was always full because no one was getting lapped because you had to pit so much like and it was all four tire stops right all four yeah. no two tires you usually see mm-hmm. some two tires at, at a bristol race even old no. old bristol like nope. four tires every time everybody like, had a shot it's like um old darlington racing yeah. it was uh when they had that 
the, before they repaved Darlington. Mm-hmm. Well, I think the first uh, the first pit stop because obviously we stopped. Uh, it came down, and some teams took right side just to get that track position. Mm-hmm. And I think that's the only time some teams took uh, took just right side, yeah, just to get that position. Gotcha. Outside of that, the next eight eight the nine stops, yeah, it was definitely all four tires, right? Yeah. Which Bristol, which I love Bristol because. Uh, if you know the history behind Bristol, it's a lot of beating and banging, guys spinning each other out, you mm-hmm. know, to get the win. Yeah. You got guys throwing helmets at cars. You got some punches been thrown with different drivers. So when you got that many pit stops and it's changing in and out, it just create that big buzz and yeah. what the fans want to see. Yeah. Like everyone was saying, when it's going long, it get kind of boring. Mm-hmm. But you can mix it up a little bit, beating and banging. I yeah. think that's what everybody want to see. Yeah, yeah. I love that part. Got them folks on the edge of their seat. Come on now, come out. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> love but it. Every, love but every, it. Every, everybody, like I think, especially when their favorite drivers aren't the ones up up front. Yeah, like, they were like, I hate it. <laughs> you know, <what laughs> I mean? you know. But uh, a, a lot of people did did enjoy Absolutely. the race. Um, mm-hmm. I don't know if we see that uh, caliber of tire wearing again. Um, who knows? But who knows? Who's to say? Maybe. Yeah, who knows? Who knows? Like, and we and we've we've seen it a lot this year from different races where it it, it like NASCAR will maybe see something that that looks like it works. Like, okay, and, and hold mm-hmm. on to it. Yeah, yeah mm-hmm. I can. I like that. I like that. No one predicted it. Yeah, I like that you got there and like Crucci was like, oh. Like, yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, fellas, we might need. Yeah, we might do, need to do some stops here. <laughs> hey, hey, it's getting out of hand. You speak like, during the crew chief. I mean, yeah. NASCAR. Like, hold on, we got to get these teams some more tires. Yeah, right, 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 right. Right. out of tires. They had to go that and get cool. everybody. That's yep. Yeah. And I like even the playing field too because uh, Reddick Reddick was running up front, and I think yeah. like they were the first to not do a pit stop. Like caution came out, they didn't mm. pit, mm. and then. Like I think coming around like three or four, they got they got bumped and yeah. turned and turned sideways. See what like, that got you? Tire you? wear. So, so yeah. and and just like just like said, uh, they got bumped, went side. They, they had no grip, right? Yeah. After a while, but at the same time, you coming into the pits with those tires are worn out. Mm. There was cars sliding, sliding all over they the were box. Bad. They were <laughs> bad. through the boxes. Yeah. Um, there was the breeze in our in our in our, in our pit guns. During tire tire exchanges, yeah. you your the sockets had debris from the from the tires in them. So it was like it felt like uh it felt like you was battling at the last great Coliseum. Yeah. It, was, yeah. it was like yeah. you was fighting the lines and everything, whatever yeah. they throwing at you, you, yeah. you was out there fighting and digging. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure that's what it looked like. That's you exciting, know, man. I, I love that kind of stuff, like not being able to predict. Like, all right, man, Bristol's been like this for 20 years. And yeah. then you show up and you're like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. I, I think that's pretty cool, especially like if you're a fan and you've been, you've been coming to Bristol 20 years. Like, and yeah. you always know who's going to be good. And you get there and it's just something you've never seen before. Like, right. that's, that's kind of exciting, man. Like, yeah. I think they got something there. You know? Yeah, yeah. I, I don't think they should change nothing up. Well, hey, and, bring and, it. and it's other teams, like, we know we know who won Denny. Yeah. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Denny came out came out on top. Um but then you got like uh Rick Ware. They had two two cars in the top twenty first time for the organization. Big for that program. Yeah. yeah. Big for that Shout program. Out to them, man. Yeah, yeah. So it, it was a Who's it, driving the fifteen? Uh I don't know. I don't got a clue. But Haley yeah, was I know the Haley is Haley was a fifty one. Yeah. yeah. Uh I think uh John Hunter Nemechek. In the uh, top ten as well, I think he finished like six. Mm. Yeah, that's my rookie. So, so rookie. Yeah. that's your guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's your boy, man. Yeah, I was. Uh, <laughs> who say early? The, um, oh, David Gillen. That's what. That's another dad that you was hanging yeah, out yeah, with. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so Joe Nemechek. Joe, boys, Joe Nemechek. Yeah, my <laughs> first cup deal was pitting for Joe, and then later on in life, I got to pit for John and his late model car. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, boy, the LeBron is like the LeBron. Man. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Yeah, the father son package, yeah, man. man. Seeing all the generations. Brian Wild though, he beat up on their daddy, then turn around and beat up on their son. That's crazy. Crazy. That's crazy. Crazy, crazy. crazy work. Crazy work. Crazy yeah. work. Given a gener like a family's like generations <laughs> work is wild. <laughs> Yo. Like giving yeah. everybody 40, 40 points oh, a game. Man. Yeah. Like give the grandpa, the dad, the son. Uh, so who, everybody crazy. getting forty. I think the next father son combo might be <laughs> since I pit it for Harvard and maybe Keelan. Keelan's up and coming. Maybe I stay around until he until he get on, and that might be my last stop. That's who rock. <laughs> yeah, it might be. I might stay stay around for that. Be the last one, last pit stop in the family tree. Yeah, yeah. 
The um, anybody can do it. You can do it, Cap. Hey, I got. Hey, I think, yeah, right, man. I thanks for the motivation. You guys are very. You know, man. Yeah. Good to have some good good people in my corner. Yeah. <laughs> You know what I mean? You need that when you get up there in age, right? Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. That's what it was. <laughs> Mike, <laughs> Mike Tyson, gonna, who's going to be in his corner? Hey, you know? You don't need nobody. Tyson, he's, he's up there. Him. He'll beat him all the time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. He's older than me. He, he needs some good people in his corner. The uh, Oh, one thing we've got to mention, though, you know, the, um, you know, Bristol going from dirt. Oh yeah, talking about Bristol going from dirt, man. You know, we we didn't do pit stops then. They were Everything. controlled, right? They were controlled yeah. pit stops. Yeah. yeah, no, yeah. It was we didn't go up for it. So, what is the reason for the going to dirt in the first place? To get a Something. bigger fan base or spice it up? Listen, the, listen. There's a lot of dirt track fans. I went in. The, I went in the meetings when they decided it. But I'm telling you, Bristol was his own competition. Yeah, and that fall race, if you you know, to compete with that fall race. I you gotta spice it up a little. Yeah, spice it up think, a little bit. I, I think doing the dirt and going back to the roots was good. I even yeah. saw you even saw some fans still wishing that it was still dirt racing there. Yeah, yeah. Um, but you bring a different type of crowd, you yeah. know, for that. You know, the, the trying to cater to the fans is, is just what it's about, right? Like, right, right. And that's like, yeah. you get enough people to ask for. It. It's like, all right, give it a shot. Yeah, we throw it up. Because I think other dirt races been there as well, not NASCAR, but. Other events oh. they host that in dirt, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I don't know if y'all know. Not for sure. I, I think, think so. when they bring when they do that, they run some other stuff there. Yeah, like, yeah, for yeah, sure. Yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, I think that's a lot of work. A lot of work. Probably shoot, shoot dumpster loads of. <laughs> <laughs> right. I, I can only imagine, bro. Like, because I'm sure it was a lot. Like to get that football field in there. Right. You know, change out whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. But like to get a full like dirt track in there. Yeah. And like, cause you have to put water on it too, right? Yeah, yep. Yep. like you have to put water on it, make it slicker yep. enough to drive on or something like that, so it don't yep. just blow off in the wind. Right, right. I'm sure, that's a, that's a lot of effort. Yeah, right. yeah. That's something I don't, I don't think I want to have no parts of zero, <laughs> hey, zero. The, hey, the because pit crew. By the way, pit crews were not there. Yeah, the the road crews were were pitting the race car because they were controlled stops, so they had to, they had a clock, they take tires off, put them on, make adjustments, do what they need to do, then they send them back out in the same order they came down. But man, I hate it for the hall of drivers. The, <laughs> the road crew was not oh, happy. Dirt, everything was everywhere. dirty. Dirt <laughs> haulers, yeah, jags, yeah. pit yeah. box. Oh, like it, it was, man. it was and bad. It was a it lot was of bad. work, man. It's worth it if you you know if, if, if that's the type of racing you like. <laughs> if you win, it's worth it. It's you know, if you love the sport, it's yeah. worth it's yeah. worth going out there. But man, the effort it takes to get to get it done out there. So that's like Marshall playing ball. You go, you go to some fields, <laughs> and it's, it's, it's crazy. But then you know you got the Astro turf, yeah, something yeah, nice. Yeah. No lie, it reminded yeah, me of yeah, my yeah. high school football field. Yeah, just dirt, bro. <laughs> that was it. Made it so. It made it so. It, it made you want to fight to stay on your feet in, in high school when you played football because that our field was rock solid. That field yeah, hadn't dirt. been horrible, bro. bro. Yeah. So yeah. If it was field. grass or dirt. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> it may, you see a couple specks, a couple strands of grass yeah, coming out the ground, but hey, yeah. you hit that ground, bro, you go feel it. Facts. Well, what are those high schools that, that the football game was played in the, the outfield of the baseball field. <laughs> is that a thing? <laughs> depending, depending on what school. Yeah. 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 Is there even 100 yards of grass the, who, out there? What, uh, what NFL and Major League Baseball teams share the same stadium? Uh, yeah, nah, uh, the 49ers. Yeah, 49ers. Yeah. You, you watch some of the old 49ers games. Then yeah. if it rained, damn, yeah. wait, cat, that's your squad. Yeah, you, you yeah, know, yeah. You watch some of the old 49ers games. They mud, muddy up, bro. Slipping and sliding <laughs> everywhere. But yeah, go check out some of those uh, old 49ers games. You see yeah. your big ass dirt, bro. Just dirt. Yeah. And they out there playing in it. So yeah, getting it yeah. done. Come yeah. on. <laughs> hey, you gotta do them what you gotta do. But them, them boys they don't. They don't. They don't know how good they got it now. You know, they, they arguing over um, contracts, getting... Yeah, yeah. Are you talking about... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Different generations. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, they, 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 they ain't getting their cleats dirty. Yeah. That generational yeah. stuff be kind of yeah, crazy because you always got old heads like chiming in on what's going on now. Because, I mean, yeah. obviously, like, time development, it's just going to... Inflation, all kind of other stuff, ticket prices yeah. up. Like, yeah. 
obviously guys just gonna get paid different than what was going on back in the day. The way contracts work are different, and then you got guys like a big difference. Like yeah. t- was it is it was it Tiki or Ronde? Oh, uh, Tiki, Tiki Barber, Tiki Barber, running back for the Giants was like yeah. Saquon got his contract with the Eagles because New York didn't want to pay him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Tiki was like, man, you're dead to me. Why, yeah, <laughs> like, why would he say you're dead? A to old me. head being an old head. Sometimes yeah. you so caught up in your feelings, you emotional and not understanding what that guy been right. through, and right. when yeah. somebody <laughs> come and show. Hey man, we like you. Somebody come show value and love you. Yeah. Absolutely, I take that. And, and pay, I'm getting guaranteed. And pay what? and pay him what he wants to get paid. Come on, so man. So he can support his family. But then like, you got hey, another guy. Yeah. <laughs> you got another guy saying you're dead to me. <laughs> what? I mean, well, it look like I made the right decision. <laughs> Sound like a hater know, to man. me. I don't know, man. I'm just sitting there thinking about it. As much time I don't put in with y'all, and y'all them leave, leave, leave me. You know what I mean, y'all. Hey. You ain't that guy, Cap. You, <laughs> hey, you be like, hey, Marshall Prada, you and your yeah, family, bro. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, y'all ain't going. Hey, y'all, y'all boys ain't going nowhere. I wouldn't yeah. be like that, Cap. But I think yeah, Ryan Clark uh, lashed back out at Tiki though. Like, yeah. hey, for these, this what you veteran guys in the locker room yeah. should not be. Right. You know, don't be a hater, yeah. man. Congratulate these young. That's guys. getting too much involved in the drama too. For yeah. sure. For sure. I remember yeah. uh I've seen some NASCAR stuff like that too, man. I'm not gonna lie. Like yeah. I remember when uh it was an Xfinity race and Mike Harmon. <laughs> Mike <laughs> Harmon Mike Harmon got us to a fender bender with somebody and they got on Twitter, started yeah. barking at each oh, other. Going back like, to Twitter fingers. Twitter fingers, oh, he was like, hey. <laughs> oh, Twitter beef. He told Brad, he was like, Hey man, if you got an issue, you can come on down to the Apple Bees. Oh, in whatever man. city they were in, we could sort it out. Wow, that's crazy. Hey, I would have pulled up for that. The yeah. Applebee's? Would, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would have pulled up. But it's, not, yeah. it's public. It's out in public, so everybody. It's like a tweet up. Yeah, yeah. man. Get you one of them dollaritas and go yeah. sort out your issues. <laughs> <laughs> Un- unbelievable. Got me some popcorn, pull the van up, man. Just wait, just wait for it. I would have, yeah. yeah. I, oh, man, good time. That's what, hey, that's what's coming, though. That's what's coming, man. It's about time for a good scuffle. Yeah, yeah been waiting on it. Yeah. Love it. I haven't seen time. a good one. Um, <laughs> I want to throw hundred bucks. <laughs> no, yeah, leave it alone. I've seen man. some good ones, man. Hey, right, out, right hey, outside my pit box. Hey, before we get last, last night, there's some good basketball games. No, nah, I agree, agree, agree. Uh, and when I turn on, you know, man, I don't watch. I don't watch a bunch because you know I'm Hornets fans, and we're actually playing pretty decent this year. But you know. Uh, and the, all the Lakers fans is just so loud. And, and <laughs> every day you got to hear about LeBron is LeBron. It's true, that, you know it's true. what I mean. And and uh, but I like to see. I, and I like to see the Lakers play, but I like to see uh, the Warriors play. Mm-hmm. Um, but man, it just makes me feel bad when when Steph can't hit a hit a three pointer like he like he yeah like he used to usually do. Man, he went four for thirteen last night. Yeah, that's yeah, from three yeah. from three points. That's unreal, yeah, man. That's that's unlike him. Almost Maybe. makes you almost makes you like it's like <sighs> younger younger generation, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But like uh, my gener like the guys I watched growing up are just solely. And then you got these new guys jumping yeah. from half court and dunking yeah. on people. Anthony Edwards, man. Like, oh, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The new guys are different, man. Yeah. You're seeing that it's starting to take over. Bro. Yeah, for sure. And speaking of younger guys, Steph, it ain't like you're a spring chicken anymore. So right. you got these young young guys. They chasing around all game. Mm-hmm. You know, so they chasing around. So it eventually he wear down. So he ain't getting them shots off that he was when he was 25 yeah. years old. Right. You know, he don't got that same lift he used yeah. to. So, uh, you're running circles for 20 seconds. Yeah, and, and that's his game. The ball that's his game. Then, so, so you know, you, you know, I just saw a stat too. You just said that Steph ain't getting getting no younger. At him, LeBron, and somebody KD. else, KD, 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 they're they're older than what Jordan was when he won his last title. Yep. So, is it done? Is it over with for these guys? Nah, who? nah. I over just who? Nah. The three, the three. Don't get me fired up. Man. <laughs> don't get me fired up about about, about King James, man. <laughs> nah, easy, easy on that. But I just well, think with these guys, when they getting older like that, you gotta b- put more support around them because yeah. they can't carry a team like they yeah. like right. like they did before. So you put some more weapons around them. Well, like and, yeah, and like, they but, to play in spurts. Yeah, you know, like uh, Clay. I mean, Clay and Steph were just splash brothers for a mm-hmm. reason. Um, but Clay was Clay was not knocking them down. But they just didn't have enough. Clay good for uh, you know one in ten games. Yeah. <laughs> so you just every now and then be like, oh, there you go. <laughs> you just had, you just had to call him that night. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you know what? What tripped me up? Oh, oh, CP3 out there. Nah, I can't, got you. <laughs> hey, lock, hey, logged in 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he, out there going to get it. I, I said, it. yeah, he was out there missing shots, but it's all, but I still, 
But I, he was in it for a minute too. Yeah, he what was, I think, what second half? 17, 17 yeah, 18 years, something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but he been doing it for a while. Still getting into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he was talking the whole time. Yeah. But you got to pay homage to Jalen Brunson and what he's doing for that organization. Oh, a young Thunder Man, game. come on, bro. Oh, oh, man, he was cutting up last night. You should have seen it. Threes, taking to the hole, yeah. getting them guys. Nobody can hold them. You got three people chasing them. He yeah. was doing it all last night. You got a lot so, of energy, man. Uh, well, younger. And what I done seen y'all two run up and down the court of the, uh, <laughs> the fitness. Easy. Fitness connect, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, y'all don't move like that dude yeah. was moving. Nah, you gotta understand that, Cap. Me and E, we got about 100, <laughs> 200 pounds on each other. It's a big difference now. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's, a, it's a big difference. And even, well, you, another guy, Josh Hart, yeah. played 48 minutes last oh, night, the 40, whole game. How many, how many minutes? No, 12. How many minutes off. None. None. Zero. Yeah, they played the whole game. The whole game. game. It's impressive. <laughs> the whole game. 48 minutes, bro. And didn't, let, didn't, didn't show no signs <laughs> of letting up. He That's gets, all right, bro. But what's your stats like? Look after forty. Yeah, he, if you uh, ain't dropped forty points after forty eight uh, minutes, he did bro, he like, a triple double. Then uh, I most likely I think he did. But it goes to show your impact and not even scoring forty. Right, but just the impact you bring, you been on the court so yeah. vac because they got a lot of people that's hurt. Yeah, they won so the they game though. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, they. Okay. Okay. Let me see. Yeah, they won the game. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, when I think that. I think when the Knicks get healthy. They gonna be a threat to Boston, but that's that's for another day. Not here, nigga. Yeah. Forty eight minutes, <laughs> yeah, and yeah. ten points. <laughs> hey, Ev, I ain't gonna I ain't gonna sleep on him though. He like hey, that. Hey, man. hey, he, hey, he, man. He, Impact guy, he, man. He's big, very. He's a big morale guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah man. Now Even you know the reason, positive. y'all. Do you know the reason before that though? Mm. Went to the coach, say he wasn't getting enough minutes. Mm. And they played oh, the but, hold, but, hold, but check this out. Check this out. Yeah. Then he went to the coach and said he getting too much minutes. So the mm. coach said you can never make him happy. So I'm just playing the whole game. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. God. Crazy. Ten. Man. Yeah. But I respect it though. It's like ten. It's like the fans, man. Like, well, y'all ain't getting enough pit stops in, in, in Bristol. Don't worry about it. We got, we got you. Drop 10 on them. Yeah. Oh, oh. Pit crew, y'all ain't working enough in Bristol? Oh, yeah, we'll you, get you. You ain't going to get many shots? Okay, watch this. Yeah. Four tires, 10 watch times. This. We got you. Don't worry about it. Four tires. Say less. Hey, no adjustments. <laughs> All right. All right. Hope you're living right that week. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Hey. We got to talk about some food, bro. Mm. Oh, man. Cap, we gotta, yeah, don't we, get me started, bro. We got to talk about the food. Don't get me started, man. Because we left, hey, y'all, we left, uh, when we left Vegas, E was talking about, like, this loco, loco moco dish. Eggs, right. And, and I told him, like, that's a Hawaiian dish. Mm-hmm. We got a place right here in Concord. Didn't even know what I was eating. Just eating hey. it. You good. Loved it. Took, him up, there, took him up there to, to uh, L&L Hawaiian barbecue. It was it was it everything that you that that I presented for you. I take my hat off my hair and look crazy, but look, man, hey, yeah. that Hawaiian spot. Yeah, it was. It, I got the same thing I had in Vegas, but it was it was everything and then some. Mm. It, was, it was double what I had in Vegas for like half the price. Yeah, it was literally like, I mean, I don't even know how to describe what I ate, but it was amazing. Yeah, the yeah. loco loco moco is it, it, the common deal is. The eggs, yes. Uh, the uh, gravy, gravy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, beef patties, hamburger steak. Yep. Oh, they had, they, had, uh, they had two there. Did they have one? They doubled down. Oh doubled yeah. Down. So it was one patty in Vegas. Yeah. They doubled down. Double down on the patties in uh oh here, here and, in uh, Concord. Concord. And and uh, a bed, not a bed of rice, oh. but a, a whole <laughs> field of <laughs> like. The whole pot, the like, whole pot. Like, got, like when you when you make the, I'm pretty sure when they make that rice, whatever packet it came in, and it was like um, three or four servings. Yeah, it's got, you <laughs> they just put got, the whole. Thing. It's like a, it's like a, ba- the whole bag per yeah, plate. Yeah, yeah. yeah like yeah. I would love to know because it came out fast. Like I want right. to know how much rice they have back there, like ready to go, a lot. They to already it. cooked. Yeah, they, they got to have for them to give us that much. It's crazy. The amount of rice they put in there is unreal. Man. I couldn't finish it. Yeah, so. Y'all want to know the reason why I ain't talking? They left me yesterday, but it's all yeah. good. Hey, Jerry said that too, bro. I'm sick of y'all, bro. It's all me, good. Me and Cap been talking about <laughs> the Hawaiian all place week. all week, bro. Uh-oh. Cap said, I'm going to take hey. you on yep. Monday. Hey, I get ain't it. nobody said a word. Hey, I get it. Yep. I get yep. it. Yep. You know, maybe next maybe next month. Hey, the com the convo sound it, it sounds so good, man. But now Marshall done been there, though. Yeah, I've been there a couple times. Right. Yeah, hey, we, hey, Cap, for those looking at Jerry. Yeah. For those who don't know when we going, 
That might be our Monday thing, Cap. Monday. Oh, let's do it. The Monday. Hawaiian, the Hawaiian, Hawaiian joint on Mondays. I heard that. So Y'all heard that. LL. It ain't gonna L&L. be no mystery. Let's do it. And they had Monday. like the they had like the special for the uh, little. I don't even know what you call them, bro. It was like a it was like meat. Rice wrapped in and seaweed. It's like a brick of rice. <laughs> See, that, that's how Pete described it. Yeah. <laughs> a, cube, a rice cube. <laughs> a block of rice a block, yeah. with a meat so, wrapped in so seaweed the M. with so, the sauce. It starts with an M. I can't. It, it's not a. Masubi. Su, Masubi. Masubi. Yeah. Yeah. That was all right. But, but it was cool. So the next, but the next one, they got the. Um, the little, we're going we're gonna to try a little bit of everything on the menu. How Man, about that? I'm going to run through that menu. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right, all right. We run through that menu and then we uh right now we're gonna run up on out of here. <laughs> you know, out of now. We're gonna get on up out of here. You know what I mean? We don't talk about everything that need to be talked about, everything that uh, need to be need to be discussed. Did we miss anything today, yo? Nah man, we I think we're good. Cat, yeah. you know we ain't missing. We can't miss, brother. Yeah, we can't miss. I will pick Zane up for soccer practice, man. I'm about to V line oh, Zane Smith? baby girl right now. Who you gotta get Zane Smith? <laughs> Both of my <laughs> 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 My son's name is Zane. Bro. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You let the people know. Yeah, let the people know. Hey, but we out of here, though. Ah. You already know what it is. We got to get up out of here. Get on the action hall. Action hall. Hey, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. Break, yeah, yeah. Break, yeah. yeah. Break, yeah. Break, yeah. Break, yeah. Break, yeah. I'm going to do it like a driver do. Break, yeah. Hit the break, yeah. Hit the break. Watch me do it like a driver do right. Bet I put a driver in the wall if he close to me yeah. I'ma hit the turn full speed Watch me show the mm. victory Got it in the bag like some groceries Supposed to be the best, ain't nothing less More mobile team mm. hanging with the bosses Put some commas on my contract yeah. We ain't taking losses, I'ma wreck them on the pace Not right. a bird, it's a plane nah. Yeah, that's cap on that race Got right. the hell out my lane right. We can bump like a bass mm. Me no explain yeah. at the top of my game mm. Me no complain Mmm.